Is that Mark? We have your number recorded from the last call. How are you feeling today? I'm... I can't remember what was said in the last call. Well, Mark, you talked about how you were feeling. You weren't in the best of places, see. But, uh, we had a good conversation. I, I think it helped. Right. How are you feeling today? I had a bad dream about my office. There were no walls. I, I couldn't see the walls. There were desks, rows of desks. I remember that. And people, but no faces. And this sound, this squeezing, banging sound. And anyway, I woke up and I was hot and I, I thought I needed a drink. So I went into the kitchen. I opened the tap, but no water came out. So I went to turn on the main light and there's a mirror hanging on the wall next to the light switch. When the light came on, I couldn't see my face in the mirror. I thought I'd gone blind, but obviously I was still asleep. When I eventually properly woke up, the bed was so soaked in sweat that I had to change the sheets. Tell me how you're feeling today. Today? Yes. You know what? Today, everything is crystal clear. In what sense? In the sense that I now know what it was that was holding me back. Holding you back from what? From doing what I need to do. I think I was afraid of leaving a mess, but then it dawned on me like an explosion. I couldn't leave a mess even if I wanted to, and there's no waking up from that. I feel like it would be useful, Mark, if we Look, actually... whatever your name is, I just... You don't need to try to help me. I'm not asking for your help. I guess I just wanted to hear a voice. I'm sorry if that's wasting your time. It's Amy. My, my name's Amy, and I'm happy that you called me Mark. You're not wasting my time. I want you to know that. I want you to know that I truly want to be here with you now. And if you call me tomorrow, I'll be there with you then. I would really like to be able to hear your voice tomorrow. Amy. Yes? It's just too fucking late. Hello? Hello? Hello?